Hey guys, hope you guys are having a great day. I'm Robert. I'm at the last Luby's in Austin, Texas. Boy, is it blinded by the light here. So I just enjoy eating my uh, fried fish, rice, and macaroni and cheese. Let's see if I can get the name of the place. Where is the word Luby's on here? Luby's to go, yeah. I bet you could see it in the background. So the Luby's that I used to go on in Steck and Mopac, I think that's what it's called, closed down after a long time. My my grandmother's mother used to treat me to Luby's and I used to get the fried fish, macaroni and cheese and um, roll in chocolate icebox pie. It was so much fun. So yeah, I wish cafeteria, oh, okay, I, I need to get in the car. Here's the chocolate icebox pie. Okay, I need to move over. So here it is, Leanne. Here's the pie. Can you uh, keep put it in a safe spot? Okay. So I enjoyed. This is in East Austin. It's east of I-35. That's where Lu that's where Luby's is. It's a really great cafeteria in in East Austin. If I can uh, where's the I'll show you the sign if I can. <laughs> this is really awkward. Let's see. Can I get the sign in the camera? There we go. There's the sign. Luby's sign right there. I'll just be like Joe Donaldson and just uh, finger point to it the best I can. It's a really good restaurant to go to. I consider it a restaurant, not a cafeteria. Control City Waco. Uh, Todd, I don't think uh, Waco is a bad control city, but I understand why you would want I-35 sign for Dallas instead of Waco because it is a much bigger city, but Waco is... Waco is a pretty good control city. There we go. So that's Luby's. They made a big mistake closing Luby's on Steck, Mopac. I think Steck is just the street that it's on. It's on. It was on a huge, gigantic hill. Hill. H I L L. I can't pronounce it very well sometimes. So I'll talk to you guys later. I enjoyed my fish, rice macaroni and cheese. I'll eat my pie tomorrow for breakfast. Bye. Have a nice day.